Hello and welcome to Brothers, a tale of two sons. The last time we left off, we were trying to figure out this puzzle. However, I opened the game and it immediately became clear we needed the big guy to come up here and get hold of this lever and that's going to open the cage. So I believe what we need to do, considering this guy here can get in and out of the back of the cage, we're going to need to open the door, go in the cage, and do this. We squeeze out the back, and then we let go. Ah, and then he's caged, he's locked. He's never getting out, and then yeah, this guy's gonna be more than happy to come over and help us get up. So it seems like not all ogres are nice. This is a bit of a crazy ogre, he's got some weird earrings going on there, I'm not really sure. Uh, we won't judge him. But there's some mean ones as well, so maybe uh, the case is that these ogres are being kept as slaves or something similar. Who knows? I guess we will find out. Maybe we have to save the ogres before we get the... This guy's not very good at this climbing game, are you, guy? Okay, hold on. And then climb. Um, do I have to... No, grab on. And then... Do I have to grab on to him? Because he, he really sucks at climbing. He won't even go near it now. Get on. And then don't let go. Okay, he made it this time. Um, maybe it was my controller sticking. Who knows? Alright, let's go. So this guy's gonna help us go somewhere now. Where are you gonna help us go, buddy? Or do I need to make him go somewhere? I do! He's gonna go on the roady thing, and we are gonna go around, and we're gonna activate this lever, and that should help us get the ogre to where he wants to go. Hopefully, because of that... Come on, grab on, little buddy. Come on. Ah. In fact, it would seem that we control where he goes completely. So if we put this like this, it would be possible for us to jump across. Let's see if we can spin the camera the right way, and let's see what was over here, though. I'm not really sure what that's going to do if we are to move him to the other position. Let's give it a go, and let's just find out what happens if... How do you... How, no, this way, please. Oh, almost. No. There we go. What if we go this way? What does that do for us? I see. If we do this, is he going to get off and... Hold on. And is he going to create a bridge for us? Go on, buddy. You can do it. There we go. And then will he jump off here and will he make us a bridge? Ah, oh, we've got to drop him off. And then... I think my controller might be broken. <laughs> and then we need to turn this back. No. Come on. Uh, like that. And then we need to make this a bridge for us to get over as well, so that he can help us from the other side. Okay, I think I get this, I think I get this, I think I get it. Let's find out if I get it. So I think we got to put it there, and then go up here. And that way, we should be able to jump across. Yes, we are more than able to jump across. It's not even a problem. Brilliant! Okay, let's swap these guys over to on the right side of the controllers. And let's try... And get through the next section. Are you going to let us through and then what? Are you going to come too? Yeah, you're coming too. I think it might be a lady. I think this might be a lady ogre. I didn't know they existed. Fiona. Oh, who's this? Hey, it's the guy from in the first place. <gasps> Is that his wife? Are they lovers? No way. They've been reunited thanks to us. <clears throat> we are doing such great things for people right now. We are really brilliant. Oh, look at that. Look how happy they are. Oh, I'm so <gasps> Uh-oh, that's not good. He does not look friendly. Um... Okay. Do I get- do I control these people at any point? I guess I do. Uh, maybe not. Okay, so what's he pointing at? He's pointing at the middle thing, so I'm guessing... I've got to pull the lever. What does the lever do? Okay, it makes that wobble. How is that of any use? Right. If I go over here, he's going to follow me, isn't he? What if we both go to each side? Um, I think maybe I've got to do something with the chains. Ah, I see. Ah, oh, hold on. I've got it. I think I've got a... Yeah, I've got to make him charge into each thing, and then that will open the middle, and I guess I've got to make him go through the middle. Come over here, buddy. Come over and get me. It's a trap. Ah, <laughs> look at that. He's breaking everything, but 
It's got to be done, unfortunately. I don't think I need to be doing this yet. Oh, that one was close. So now what happens when I pull this lever? It opens. Oh, why aren't you pulling the big brother? Oh, look what you've done now. You're way too late. Okay, we've got to time this much better. Okay, now. There we go. See you later. Okay, and now this guy should help us up. What are you pointing at? What do you want us to do? Do you want us to do something else? I don't want to make him... I guess we can make him fall. Um, there must be something else. If we pull this lever again, what does it do? Nothing. Right. So what was he pointing at? He's pointing over here. But I'm not sure what he's pointing at. Maybe we can do something with this chain. Maybe we can save the bad ogre. We can whistle. Right, that's not much use. Let's go and have a, let's go see what this guy wants. He's pointing over there, but maybe he doesn't mean it. Oh, he fell. Oh, we just need to wait for him to fall. Okay, I'm not sure how I made him fall, or if I made him fall. Either way, he fell. And now, we should be okay to get a lift up by Mr. Ogre. Thank you very much. What's gonna happen now? We're gonna leave the caves, possibly. I don't look like we need to save the rest of them. Maybe we'll come back to that. I mean, there was a lot of them, and these big ogres are kind of scary, but we're not too bad against them. I reckon we could probably take them. And they're gonna show us where the tree is. This way. Yeah, thanks, bud. Thanks, Fiona. Mushroom, Mushrek. Let's go on, on our happy little way to wherever it is we're going next. This scenery is so nice. I love the, I love the graphics in this game. They're very, very cool. Where are we off to? I wonder how close we are to the tree. I doubt we're close yet. We haven't been playing it that long. Uh oh, this is back at the house. This is the, uh, this is our dad, I believe, that we're trying to save. And this is the, uh, the guy who's saving him. Oh, he looks very ill. This isn't good. Hopefully we can manage to get to this tree in time. Otherwise, that's going to be heartbreaking to say the least. <laughs> but I've been told to expect a very emotional roller coaster. So who knows what is going to happen. He seems okay though. Well, despite being incredibly sick, he's he's alive. So that's something. What's in the sky? Lots of stars. It's a very nice night. It's a very clear night. It's never that clear here. Okay, back to us, I guess, and then, oh, campfire! Look at that, we've got, we've got a little fire going, keep them warm, on our way to the trees. I'm still not too sure what's so special about this tree, I imagine it's some sort of herb, oh wow, there's some wolves. Uh oh, we're gonna eat them by wolves. Dude, you might wanna wake up. Get up, right now. You're gonna be eaten by wolves, get up. And you. Don't touch it. It's probably very warm. Yeah, wake him up because uh, he's not going to fend very well if he's asleep. It's a nice, nice little shelter you've got there, though. Okay, so he's pointing that way. So what does that mean? Does he lead the way? And are the wolves scared of the light? No. <laughs> they most certainly aren't scared of the light. Okay, well he points that way. So I'm not going to listen and go this way. Because there's no wolves over here. Oh, but they are following us. Oh, and we can't go this way, so now I'm going to eat my wolf! Oh no. Alright, so how do I do this then? If I use action, what does that do? Ah, I see, so maybe I can get them to go away? Yeah, they back off when I swing this at them. There we go. So that's what I want to do. Get back! Get away! Get away, wolf! This is my brother slash dinner. You cannot eat him! Right, I wonder if one's going to creep up behind us. Possibly. I should probably check. But I don't think I'm going to. I guess we'll keep heading through this terrifying forest and just look out for eyes. Because we are in a very lucky position where we can see the... Oh, wow. This is um, not the place I would like to be, especially if I was a kid. Uh, just keep looking at the floor, buddy. It's going to be okay. Get back, wolf. Get back. You're no match for my fire. Can't get close enough to make him run away. There we go. Run, wolf, run. Alright, we're out of the forest. The worst forest in the world. 
and we are coming up into a graveyard by the looks of it. Brilliant. That's much better than the people that have hung them, well, been hung, hanged even in the trees. Okay, we are now at a very magical looking scary graveyard. So, I think we'll call it there. I do hope you have enjoyed this video. If you have, you know what to do by now. If you want to see a little bit more, well, yeah, you still know what to do. Yeah, I'll see you next time.